just select. I can just select the second one. Okay. And it should be working. But why it's not... Ah, when I'm moving, it's moving up and down and it's, it's just uh, hitting. But I will show you how I just achieved that. I was trying to uh, do the same, but yeah. Unfortunately, it was C++ uh, class, uh, so I couldn't remove this. So probably I would have to uh, create another project, copy character and create everything from the beginning. beginning. But yeah, right now I will show you how uh, it works. Mm, so character, the second one, which I just imported, has uh, this um, uh, static mesh in front of my camera. But more important is just uh, what I have in my graph. So uh, I just uh, use my start location and start rotation of this uh, uh, static mesh of this uh, weapon. And every tick I just uh, set my relative location. Uh, I'm just getting my uh, game time in seconds and uh, using my sinus function. That's why it's going from minus one to one every time. And I'm just uh, setting my new location. That's why when I'm just walking, it's just going up and down like sinus function. And when I'm just pressing uh, one key, it's just uh, shaking this. And this is second. Uh, ah, and one more thing. Uh, when I just stop moving, there is a linear inter interpolation uh, with a vector. So this is just like that. Mm. Maybe once again. Okay, there is a lot of things to do, so still, uh, yeah. Mm. Hello. <laughs> All right. Thanks. <laughs> okay. Uh. <clears throat> so, uh... I just get my character movement and get velocity. So when I'm moving, I just check if uh, it's higher than zero. So it means I'm moving, yeah, right here. Is character uh, moving? And when it's moving, I just multiply by six. So I get zero or six and uh, multiply by this value. So I get zero or six. If it's zero, it's just adding nothing. But if it's six, it's just adding from minus six to six. That's why it's just going up and down here. Yeah. And I'm controlling this by my character movement. And second thing is just this uh, relative rotation. This is just uh, uh, interpolation uh, for rotation. So this is just going back when I just stop attacking. But more important is just this uh, timeline. Uh, as you can see, it's just going from uh, value 0 to 1 and uh, straight to 0. So it's just like attacking once and going back, attacking once and going back, attacking and going back, and go on and go on. And this value from 0 to 1 uh, is just uh, setting relative rotation from start uh, rotation to end rotation. It's just a linear uh, yeah, interpolation between this, these two values, uh, but we are using 0, 1, yeah? Okay, so this is uh, this is everything. And this is going back and, yeah, that's why I'm using these effects. So right now I can just uh, use my items I just created. Yeah, and it will be like that, this. I can even uh, uh, increase this uh, uh, amplitude, yeah. So it will be just looking. Yeah, but I think it's it's kind of okay. So uh, so let's change to our uh, weapon. Weapon. 
I'm not sure if it's okay. Okay, so uh, yeah, I don't know why anyone is writing anything. Uh, Raz, 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 okay, hey. So, uh, okay, so I can take my meshes right now. Okay, and I can use them, uh, yeah. So we will see how it looks uh, with our uh, character. So basically, uh, yeah. I need to replace this uh, static mesh and one more thing because we have two characters and I don't need this uh, first one I can just remove this probably so let's find this first character first person character uh -huh. let's find him and I can just remove him and second one will be just what <laughs> we had two of them i don't know why this is kind of weird what the fuck <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I'm removing, but it's not removing. Uh, what's going on? What the fuck? Okay, let's save this. Don't save map. Let's go back and let's open this project once again. I think this is by, uh, because I have my character right here, so maybe I should first remove this classes. So let's go. I'm making a game, uh, not a mod. So this is basically a whole game just made on one stream, from beginning to the uh, begin to the end. Just adding uh, things after thing, uh, yeah. So I started from generating endless word, then C++ project, voxel generation, terrain, simplex noise, different voxel types, and making uh, new web pawns using BSP. And right now I'm prototyping character. So, uh, yeah. Okay, so maybe just uh, create new level, let's play, so this is my effect of uh, attacking, and when I'm walking it's just coming, uh, going up and down, so this is, this is fine, so I need to replace this uh, item right now, what's going on, let's attach actor to actor, which is... Ah, I know what's going on. I don't need this for now. This is just for post process effect, but we are not there yet. Okay, so this is our pawn, first character, uh, person character, and I can just take my mesh in viewport and replace with a mesh shower. What? <laughs> okay, but uh, we need to rotate this probably. And this is kind of big, so uh, how we can just adjust this? Uh, maybe just point 0.1, point 0.1, point 0.1. This is more uh, size like it should be. Mm, just rotating this maybe this way. Rotating this way. Is it is it fine? Maybe this way. 
let's move this right here maybe just uh, 10 and check this out I hope uh, it will be fine <laughs> it's still okay <laughs> great but it's moving up and down okay so it has to be smaller uh, not this one uh, so yeah uh, let's just make this smaller uh, what's going on it's my viewport mm -hmm. okay let's try this out still it's kind of big mm. I don't know why maybe two Okay, but I should be moving. Uh... Okay, I still need to rotate this and make maybe this bigger. So maybe just four. Okay, it's too big. Thirty-two. Okay. And I'm I'm hoping uh, every other item will be will be the same. And I need to rotate this. I'm not sure how it should. Okay, let's rotate this slightly, and it should be fine. Uh... Ah. What? Why I'm closing this every time? I don't know why. If this is still not, uh, maybe it should be like that. Hmm. It's kind of. Uh, this is interesting. I don't know <laughs> what I'm doing, uh, basically. Should be maybe like that. Okay, let's play. I don't know. Okay, I hope this is looking more like it should. But this attack effect is not the best. And maybe just move this to the right. I can change uh, Z. Why not? Okay, still uh, there is something to improve. But it looks uh, kind of okay. I don't know why. Hmm. Okay, let's... Let's just move... Uh, put this... And rotate this. Uh -huh, let's try this out. Okay, so I need to move this to the right and should be fine. Maybe like that. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's say it's. <laughs> okay. Why not? Uh, but this material has to be visible, so maybe just change color. Mm, but it is uh, okay, so maybe a missive color will be better. Uh, let's try this out. Okay, so right now it should be. Yeah. And yeah, one more thing. I think that should be 
because it's it's thicker than I expected, yeah. So uh, uh, yeah, so maybe this last one scale will be just okay, something like that. Maybe even uh, higher, maybe two. Something like that. I'm not sure. But yeah, we can try this out. Should be more like... Let's say it's fine. <laughs> but it's rotating instead of punching. So I have to do something with this. Why not? Okay. Uh, but how an, uh, about other uh, items? We can just replace this with uh, another one. Let's try the second one. Oh my god. Mm, why it's on the bottom? Okay, everyone has different point. So I need to uh, go to 3D Studio Max and uh, just in improve this to be in the middle uh, because this is yeah kind of awkward yeah so all of these items has to get the same uh, point so I should uh, fix them and maybe uh, make them smaller but yeah I think this is uh, this is fine for now Creativity, yeah. Okay, so... Mm -hmm. I just turned the music. Dobra, okay, okay. Let's go. I will be. I will have to do something with this, so yeah. Uh, I did not expect there will be a lot of problems, so may maybe just export these. And yeah, one after another. Uh, great. Maybe new items. Uh, one, two, three, four. Uh, I can make this smaller and make this in the middle. Okay, so three this new maps. <clears throat> okay, mm. just quick fix uh, for this. Why well, it's just mm. okay? Mm. Maybe I start from the first one. Just like that. So maybe just uh, making this to 90 degrees, moving this to here, and it will be just just like that. Maybe just yeah. So every item will be like that from X to Y. Okay, should be fine. Let's. Uh, Let's export this. 
Uh-huh. Hello. <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Uh-huh. Okay, so it will be my new... And maybe just uh, escape. Okay. Let's try this out. I can replay this. Let's check this out. If it's better. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, we import. Hmm. Why it lost materials? Oh, what the fuck? Just screw up. Hmm, I was sure there is uh, material in this. Just like that. Okay, I just need to go. Hmm. Good that, I, uh, that I'm, I made copy of this, so I can just remove this and uh, just use another static mesh. Okay. Okay, so this is my. I can just use this. Mesh. Hi, hi, hello. <laughs> okay, let's go back. Okay. Okay, so I will do this uh, maybe later on. So for now, I will just go to. Uh, next step adding and re removing voxels okay so my character is almost ready I just need to set my uh, meshes but uh, as you can see uh, as you can see this is uh, not so easy because I need to uh, change these meshes because they are too big and uh, with having different center po points yeah and uh, they have to be the same uh, in the same way yeah starting from the same point mm, yeah so basically uh... hmm. dum, 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 dum. Okay, never mind. Uh, okay, how it looks? It's so bad. I will just uh, make this higher, and it will be fine. So I will be using this one. Okay, never mind. This is not so bad. Need some improvements. Okay, so right now I just go to my uh, game mode and use my uh, uh, first person character 2 and second one controller will be just new one. Just to generate this once again. So I will take care about... Uh... Okay, but I need... Uh... Is false uh, just to uh, enable collisions. 
because right now we have no collisions. Okay, and compile. What is uh, my favorite text editor? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Notepad. <laughs> Word is uh, fine too. Microsoft Word. Uh, text editor. Okay, so right now I should get collisions. Let's try this out. Yeah. Okay, so I have my and even weapon, yeah. So it's not so bad at all. But we need also cursor. And to make uh, this cursor visible, and our character is just uh, jumping not, not high. So we need to set everything. But this weapon look uh, kind of okay. Okay, so yeah. And I can reduce this uh, range of uh, rendering. Because it's just not uh, working as it should. So maybe radius of my rendering should be smaller. Uh, yeah, render range will be just six. It should be fine. Okay, so uh, adding and removing voxels, and also I need to show uh, mouse cursor. So uh, we will just go to HUD. Mm -hmm. So let's go to blueprint and I can just create new hat. Okay, new one. And we need to show something on the screen. So I just get a uh, receive uh, draw hat. And I need something uh, what is basically uh, in every new project, so I will just copy this from new project and or other project. Uh, it doesn't matter. So uh, it will be just. It should be right here, but it's ev everywhere. Just to showing uh, cross cursor on the on the screen. <laughs> Maybe I should. <laughs> Może powinienem. Uh, I don't know. Okay, so we have first person and uh, I can go to my HUD. First person HUD, okay. And there is something like drawing cross her in center of the screen. I can just take this. So, and it will be fine. Just linking this. And right now we should get this uh, cursor on the screen, this uh, cross, cross hair. Yeah. Okay. It's a weird, weird name. Yeah, this is English chat. Okay, so I have this red one cursor on the screen, which is great. But still, my uh, character is not jumping high, so basically I need to set uh, this jump. And I need to check something. It was okay. Okay, so made, uh, make this character uh, jump uh, high enough. So let's change this character uh, movement. And it will be just gravity scale 2, jump velocity 700, air control half, and uh, it's like that, but uh, we need probably make this voxels 100 by 100 then, yeah, because it's 200. That's why it's my, my problem. So, what? It's still here, I don't know why. Uh, and uh, settings, it will be just voxel size 100. It should be fine. Let's try this out. So I should be able to jump on one. Okay. 
Okay, and I'm able to walk on this. So this is great. And this is uh, more like it should be. Great. So we should be able to remove these voxels and adding new one. Hi. <clears throat> Uh, okay. Oh. <laughs> I should increase size of the character. <laughs> I should uh, increase size of my monitor screen. Oh wait, uh, I should change word size. Yeah, sure. Uh, this is just prototyping 12 hours uh, challenge, so it won't take more than 12 hours. Uh, we are in fourth hour of prototyping already, so yeah, I need to speed it up. I need to rush. Yeah, and yeah, I think it looks okay. So right now we can just uh, use our set bubble, uh, set uh, voxel, and yeah, and remove voxel, and create something like that. Yeah, and he rotates his... okay, this is great. It's not so bad, okay. So, this character is finished, almost. Uh, okay, so uh, next will be just adding and removing voxels so I can go to the next step okay 